Welcome back to Healthy Care, your go-to source for the latest in health and medical news. Today, we're bringing you the top 5 groundbreaking HIV treatment stories from the Conference on Retroviruses and Opportunistic Infections, or CROI 2024. Let's dive right in. First up, we have an exciting development in injectable HIV treatment. In a large clinical trial conducted in Africa, researchers found that an injectable regimen was just as effective in maintaining viral suppression as the standard oral antiretroviral treatment. This trial involved 512 participants from Kenya, South Africa, and Uganda. The injectable treatment, using Cabot Graver and Ropivirine, was administered every eight weeks, and it showed a viral load suppression rate of 96.9%, nearly identical to the 97.3% seen with standard oral treatments. This could be a game-changer for many living with HIV. Next, let's talk about long-acting oral treatments. CROI 2024 highlighted a study on a once-weekly oral regimen using lenacapavir and Islotravir. This study involved 104 adults who were previously on a daily pill regimen. At the 24-week mark, the once-weekly group maintained a 94.2% viral suppression rate, matching the daily pill group. These findings open the door to more convenient treatment options for people with HIV. In addition to the once-weekly oral regimen, two new antiretrovirals are showing promise. Merck's MK8527 and Gilead Sciences GS1720 have undergone phase I studies. MK8527 is being developed as a once-weekly HIV treatment and a monthly PREP option. Meanwhile, GS1720 is an oral integrase inhibitor taken weekly. Both drugs could significantly simplify HIV treatment and prevention. Another critical discussion at CROI 2024 was the potential resistance to the integrase inhibitor dolutegravir. While dolutegravir remains a cornerstone in HIV treatment globally, there are emerging signs of resistance, particularly in children. Although significant resistance is still rare, it's crucial to monitor this trend to ensure the continued effectiveness of HIV therapies. Lastly, a retrospective cohort study from the U.S. revealed that switching to an integrase inhibitor around menopause can lead to accelerated weight gain in women with HIV. This study included over 2,000 women and highlighted that menopausal status should be considered when making treatment decisions involving integrase inhibitors. That's all for today's update on the top HIV treatment stories from CROI 2024. These advancements are paving the way for more effective and convenient HIV treatments, bringing hope to millions. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated with the latest in health and medical news. Thanks for watching Healthy Care, and see you next time.